Hi guys, Chet here. If you have been checking out project management platforms, you've probably seen Smartsheet mentioned a few times. It's well known for combining the feel of a spreadsheet with the power of a project tracking tool. In this video, I'll break down everything that you need to know about Smartsheet, its features, strengths, weaknesses, pricing, and more. So without further delay, let's get started. First off, let's talk about what Smartsheet actually is. At its core, Smartsheet is a cloud-based platform that helps teams manage work, track tasks, and stay organized. And through a layout that looks and feels familiar, kind of like a spreadsheet. But it does a lot more than just track rows and columns. You can create workflows, set deadlines, assign tasks, and manage documents, all from the same place. It gives you structure without feeling too technical or locked into a certain way of working. Now let's talk about features. Smartsheet will give you a flexible project view like grid, Gantt, calendar, and card view. You can build sheets for simple task lists or for more advanced project tracking with dependencies, automated reminders, and approval workflows. There are also dashboards where you can keep an eye on progress using charts and widgets, plus you can build custom forms to collect data directly into your sheets. Everything works together smoothly, making it a great fit for teams with complex needs or big project pipelines. Now, one of the biggest strengths of Smartsheet is how adaptable it actually is. It works for marketing campaigns, project development, event planning, or even operations. You don't need to use multiple tools because Smartsheet can handle a little bit of everything, from collaboration to reporting. And since the layout feels like a spreadsheet, it's not a big jump for new users who get comfortable quickly. But of course, Smartsheet isn't perfect. Some users might find it overwhelming at first, especially if they are used to simpler platforms like Trello or Basecamp. It also takes some time to build workflows and automation if you're not familiar with how those features work. And while it's strong on flexibility, it may not feel as visually clean or easy to use as some of the more design-focused tools out there. Furthermore, the platform works best when paired with other tools. Now, it does have integrations with apps like Microsoft Teams, Google Workspace, Slack, and Salesforce, but some features like time tracking or advanced analytics may require extra apps or add-ons. That's something to keep in mind now if your team relies on specific tools. Now let's take a look at the pricing. Smartsheet has four options. The pro plan is $12 per member per month. The business plan is $24 per member per month. Both support unlimited viewers. Now the enterprise and advanced work management Management plans come with custom pricing based on your team size and future needs. So overall, Smartsheet really is a great choice if you need a tool that's flexible, powerful, and works across different departments. It's not the easiest tool for beginners, but if your projects involve a lot of moving parts, it can really help your team stay on track and work together more smoothly. All right, that's it for this video. If you found it helpful, don't forget to like and subscribe there at the bottom. And as always, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you over in the next video.